Let me... It was a close call for Eleanor Dempsey. An early morning trip to catch some waves on her surfboard quickly ended after a six-foot juvenile great white shark took a huge chunk yeah, out of there? it. It was under me. It surfaced. It took the board, and I was out of here, out of there. And I don't know what. I never looked back. The attack happened in Morrill Strand Beach in Morrill Bay. It's pretty wild. I mean, it seems really surreal. Like. Like it didn't really happen, you know. It just seems very surreal at this point. Dempsey says there were several other people in the water when it happened. Where I was surfing, I was just about three feet out from the next guy, so I was just a little bit further out. So maybe I was the, the with the red board, you know. It was this? Oh, there's somebody. Boom. Oh, well, swimming for her life, Dempsey says those on the beach were screaming, coaching her to shore. So a couple of guys helped me kind of get in. One because I was paddling, and I because I, I usually you watch behind you. He's like, there's a wave coming, just hold on, which I was glad he said that because I was just paddling. And so, um, you know, then I could ride the wave in, you know, on my belly. As for her surfboard, this cancer survivor, and now survivor of a shark attack, says she's going to take a little time to figure out what to do with it. I know somebody was like, make it wall art, but I'm not sure I always want to remember that. So I'm not quite sure yet. <laughs> Sell it to the highest bidder.